Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Punk Rock Review, home of a bunch of opinionated crap you don't care about, also the home of the feedback you provide that we don't care about, keeps us on an even playing field. We like that. Real quick shout out to our sponsor. Hmm, let's see. Sponsor. Sponsor. No oh, shit. Nope. No sponsor here. Feel bad and give us money. Anyhow, oh, that's unfortunate there's no sponsor here for this one. This is going to be out of all of our videos. This one. This one will be good. Okay? Now, we're not saying our other ones are good, but this one... This one will be, okay? And we'll tell you why. Because you are about to witness someone who doesn't really like coconut and hasn't attempted to eat one of these in probably 20 fucking years try and eat and consume an almond joy. Holy shit. You might be saying to yourself, no fucking way, no fucking way someone who don't eat no fucking mounds and a fucking no almond joys is going to be able to do this shit. And we'd be saying, well, not only are we going to be able to do it, but we, now we're going to force ourselves to, out of a challenge aspect, let's write a challenge. So let's, let's not keep you waiting, man. All right. We haven't had this, one of these, or tried to have one of these, and we don't know an exact time frame. It's been fucking long decades, man. We don't like... We don't like mounds. We don't like Almond Joy. We don't like any of the coconut fucking chocolates in a fucking Russell Stover's or none of that shit. We don't eat that stuff, all right? Now we can eat coconut, stuff like that. But we're going to see how this goes. Now, everyone knows Almond Joy has nuts. Mounds don't. So that is a factor in this. All right, and you'd be saying to yourself... I eat those all the time. I love those. We be saying, <laughs> fucking gross. All right. <laughs> will we spit it out or will we make it through it? Oh, we're making it through it unless we spit it out. You can tell we're eating it. Son of a bitch. You motherfuckers. No fucking way. <laughs> no fucking way. Holy shit. We kind of like that. Never, ever in our entire lives we ever been able to finish a bite. Even though this is fun size, we'll stop there. Never able to finish a bite, let alone a bar regardless of the size of it but that's okay holy shit if there's one product that we had in our mind as far as stuff we didn't like you know, almond joys and mounds but holy shit we were able to eat that don't like the lingering little kind of coconutty pieces and stuff uh, you know, throughout, but you know, nothing a sip of water or anything won't won't swig and take care of. The chocolate aspect is delicious. And then again, we apparently loves our chocolate. Obviously. What a good little product, man. Uh we've never been able to eat an entire one of those. And that just goes to show you how palates can change over a duration or period of time. For real, we fucking hated these things. Never wanted anything to do with them, man. We thought it'd be kind of fucking fun, man. Be like, ah, oh, let's take a bite, man. Let's make some let's make some shitty content for all ones of our viewers. Hi, Mom. We're like, damn. 
Uh, yeah, that, not a bad little product, man. I mean, we ain't going to rush out and buy a fucking bag of them, but we finally learned you don't have to be afraid of what you were afraid of before. And we weren't even afraid of it. We just fucking didn't like it. And now, I don't know, we like it okay. Not enough to rush out and get a fuck ton of them, but enough to where if that's the only candy we have access to, we might eat another one. So, there you go. Almond Joy, holy shit. Never, never in another 20 fucking years did we think we would actually even like that product. And that just goes to show you, if you approach some stuff with an open mind, you might come across something in due time. I don't know. That sounded good. It sounded like it rhymed. And it sounded like it was worth a lot of money. So there you go. Almond Joy, where the fuck? What an awesome ass commercial that we've done for you. You're welcome. You kind of owe us, I don't know, $13,000 really for, you know, this great ad that we've done for you. But, you know, we digress. You know what you owe us. Uh, Almond Joy's, what can be said about you? Well, you get a good old fashioned. <laughs> Let's. Uh, yeah, a good old fashioned R. You see that up there? Are you going to the mall later? No, that's not what we're asking. Are you going to try them again? Because we needed to, and we did. We didn't need to. We, we, we were willing to. And sometimes when you're willing to do things, you might be impressed with the results. And hopefully these results impress us by us getting a fuck ton of money. So, you know, like we always say, we don't want your subscription. No, you don't. Don't subscribe to us. Our content sucks. We don't want your subscription. We want your money. We're direct. All these other channels beat around the bush like, oh, become a member of Patreon. No. Fucking we don't have a Patreon. We don't do Patreon. <laughs> we do money. Just give us money. Fuck. That's it. I'll enjoy. You owe us 13 grand. Fucking, come on now. Honor your debts. A uh, nice little product that you make. That's it. Give us money. Have a good one, you probably didn't. We'll catch you next time. Probably won't.